so that creates cognitive dissonance right and now they turn off the this this show those are the people that we're not talking to here at scribble bites we are talking to the people who can admit that and say yeah true but when i read the bible i found so many wonderful things like jesus has so many wonderful sayings and even the Old Testament has so many beautiful things that are relevant to this day. And so it's, you need to be able to, as a maverick, I know this, you know, I'm preaching to the choir. But you know how to take something useful out of something and then apply it to yourself without falling into the trap of being divisive, angry, vile, vulgar against other people and so going back to that speech by Meryl Streep that I started off with in the beginning where she says our policies remain shackled by Jordan style one worlders who insist that power is something shameful and evil and see she is fighting for power but if you've seen the movie, she's a bad, she's the bad guy. <laughs> but the great thing about the movie is that even though she's the bad guy in that movie, that speech that she has is extremely, extremely powerful. Ha ha ha, powerful. In that it's giving information that is so relevant throughout the ages. And especially now, more so than ever. Because... Our policies are shackled down by Jordan style one worlders who want to sing Kumbaya and that assumes that people are generally good and inherently good. But what she's saying is we need power, now removing it from the context of her character in the movie and just at face value of what she's saying, is that we need power because power is protection. And the way to survive as a maverick is protection. And the way you protect yourself is with information. And you get information through education, which is what we do for you at Scribble Bites. But because this is a media entity, it's a film studio and distribution company, we wrap that education in entertainment, in narrative. And what kind of narrative? A transmedia narrative. And so when you see comments from this channel or any of the characters that I play on this channel, don't take the comments at face value like a sheep. The comment is giving information. It's a concept. It's not my personal view or Scribblebyte's personal view. It's a character. It's an idea that is meant to give you information. Why? So that you can be empowered. So that you can be that young populist congressman, that war hero with heart, forged by enemy fire in the desert, in the dark, when American lives hung in the balance. You are that congressman. You are being forged by enemy fire every time you come back from a loss of innocence. Every time you overcome a loss of innocence. You are being forged by fire. You are that young populist congressman. You are Liev Schreiber, okay? And that's where the concept of the actor comes in. So, Mavericks, listening. Scribble Bites is a tool for education. The concept of me being an actor is a concept to tell you that you are are the actor of your own life and as an actor of your own life 
The only thing you need to know is whether you're a good actor or a bad actor. If you're a good actor, you overcome your loss of innocence and you use it to your advantage. If you're a bad actor, you become divisive and you use the skills you have to make other people become divisive. The choice is yours, but you're welcome to stay because you're a maverick. By now, the copper wire NPC sheeple have clicked off, but you're still here. Good.